Hello everyone, welcome to Sound and Melodies. In this episode, we're going to see how to try and solve this problem occurring with Cubase and with some plugins that creates this problem. To solve that, let's try and open Cubase in um, compatibility mode. To do that, first I'm going to locate the, the exe file. Open file source and here's the exe file. This is the shortcut. So I'm going to go in properties and in compatibility here is Windows 8 so I've selected Windows 8 and open this program in compatibility mode for Windows 8 apply I've already done that applied this is the shortcut and if you open right click and open the location of the original exe file you can do so here too to go to properties and compatibility mode and Windows 8 the second thing we're gonna do is open QS in administrator mode to do that, right click in the icon and go to more and run as administrator. If you do not want to click run as administrator each time you open Cubase, all you have to do is right click in the shortcut, go to properties and in shortcut there is advanced options where you have to click run as administrator and accept and apply. And every time I open Cubase, I'll have to go and click yes to open QS. And in this way, your QS will be running fine 